Welcome to Risu, a game I found on Steam or an indie horror. Oh, I feel like I gotta cough a lot. <coughs> oh god, maybe you got the coof. Although I'm just coughing simply. Uh, tab I inventory WSD blah blah blah. Looks normal. Ugh. No. It's disgusting. Get away from me. Hopefully it didn't mean it's converting into controls. But it was interesting looking into your game. And we're gonna find out. It's quite dark. Ah, there it goes. Well, mm, this is new. Oh. Oh, this. Okay, I thought it was like the text was still going. I'm like, what kind of, <coughs> what kind of subtitles are? Oh, it's just the interface. Okay. Huh. So we're a schoolgirl. Japanese school. She's got them legs. I gotta say, she got them chonky tomboy legs. There's no way I'm going back out there after all that. Ouch. It's too cold to touch. Huh. What this? Oh. Oh. What? Drain cleaner. Huh. Searching mechanics. I do like that. Eh, we'll go this way. Locked. Oh. An interesting uh, method of at least creating levels. These are some taut wires. I guess I might as well open all the doors. Why not? Hmm. Hmm. Open all the doors. Ugh. <coughs> oh god, so seriously. Something got like really stuck in my throat and is really horrible right now. I was just eating some food and it's just suddenly Oh, and I just can't stop coughing. It's really bugging me. Scissors. Just had to search all these drawers. Kind of troublesome. There's a lot of them. Nope, oh, we're done. So we got scissors and drain cleaner. <coughs> oh, seriously? Ugh. Horrible. <coughs> I'm dying. Magnet. Okay. I guess. Man, it would really suck if I was getting sick. And my coughing was just a sign. Now my voice is getting all fucked up. Oh no. I'll just have to talk in a gruff voice. Oh, that's fine. Okay. Maybe I'll need an umbrella. We'll go in the mail's washroom. Ha <laughs> ha. <laughs> Japanese toilets. You. Oh my god. It smells like shit. Probably because it's filled with shit. Gross. It looks like there's something in it. I am not going to touch it though. The flusher doesn't work. What if I use scissors to chop the poop up Korean style? Wait, what? Use. I'm not sure the blockage is uh, loose enough for stabbing. <laughs> I wish I had a poop. <coughs> oh god. A poop knife. Drain cleaner. I hope this is strong enough. Hey, it worked. 
the shit's all dissolved, but now that thing went down the pipe. Eh, well, I guess we'll go in the basement at some point. No, I mean, that's one puzzle solved. And yes, I'm opening all the doors even though uh, there's no reason to. I don't think there's anything in any of these. The women's washroom just has to be so boring. Whatever. What's over here? Umbrella. Umbrellas? More like yumbrellas? Like, what? I don't, I don't get if that's a reference. I have no idea what the fuck she's smoking. I don't need one. Umbrellas. Has she eaten umbrellas before? I'm concerned. Like, I'm really concerned. I don't know. I'll search around some more, I guess. I feel like I've been everywhere, though. Phone. My phone. There are newer models, but I like this one. They're a little awkward, but must be left-handed. I didn't know they actually made magnets like these. Combine. Combine with the magnet and kill your phone. Eh, I guess we just can't do anything yet. I guess we can try go to go outside. My old friend, the Void. Oh, uh, I guess not. Okay, I gotta keep searching then. Ah, uh, wait. There's something at the bottom of the pipe. Okay. Uh, I get. I get what they want me to do then. Magnet. Whatever's down there moved a little. I can't re. Ah, uh, what? Serious? What the mag? I, I need like a stick on it. I can't use the item here. So I can't use the magnet. Uh, what? I can't reach far enough with the magnet. Okay, so I need some kind of stick. Oh shit, I'm, wait, this might work. I'm gonna cut piano chords? I dropped the si oh, You're incompetent. At least I got- okay. But, okay, well instead of, I guess, the, the stereotype of crowbars breaking after one single use, we definitely did something blasphemous such as, oh, I don't know, ruin a piano? Completely? Like, seriously. I... That's... That's absolutely horrible. Test my skills. Yeah, yeah. Magnet hook. Alright. Now. Here goes nothing. Let's get that key over there. Aha! A fresh key from the sewage pipe. I'm just gonna leave my magnet contraption here. Now the question is, where the fuck does a key go? Hey, <laughs> I, I guess that makes sense, yeah. But there's many locked doors. Wait. It's also very dark out now. She called it the void, but it was bright white. Was it always meant to be dark? Uh, where did the light go? Okay, yeah. Because calling a light the void doesn't make much sense, but calling black the void... It doesn't work. Yeah. It's calling light void is kind of weird. When I think void, I think a dark color, like, like, like having your coffee black, so to speak. Then, yeah, you know, that is called void. It's not this door either. Um, I can't remember what else was missing. I think, yeah, no. Okay, I think the other door would be down. This hallway? It was the, uh, the office room. 100%. Here it is. Excellent. What is this? Blue orb! The fuck is a blue orb? It has no temperature. Okay, so it's just room temperature. Bring it outside? Someone turned off the sun, so I mean... I can't use this item here. I can't... Okay, well then just use the phone. Call someone. My phone. 
combine. Weird. Okay, well. Wait. She doesn't say anything about the umbrellas now? Weird. Alright, well, I gotta, I'm gonna search around some more and figure out what to do with the blue orb. Maybe I can use it on the stairs to get rid of the temperature then. I'm gonna assume that's exactly what the game wants me to do. <coughs> Onwards! Oh god, I'm dying. Onward and upwards! I feel fine, it's just a tickle in the throat and it's really annoying. Am I going to be playing basketball? Um, are we going to slam dunk the orb? Mm -hmm. Well, that's some weird... What? An Oni? Whoa, what? What, 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 what? Do, do I touch that? I, I think it's... What? 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 Just dodge and... I just dodge until I win? Huh? Well, that got weird extra fast. So wait, what do I do? Is it like Parasite Eve 1, where you dodge around and you attack it, but I don't have a weapon? Or do you use the orb to counter those attacks, and it becomes a bullet dodging, like, near or, or something else that's a dodging game? Bullet dodger. I can't remember the genre. Is the genre called bullet dodger? Bullet time? Bullet dodger? No, not bullet time. Bullet dodging? Genre? What, what is it called? I'm googling it. Bullet hell, ah yes, bullet hell, that's that's it. Bullet hell. Um, made me think of Nier. Obviously not to not the same extreme, but they shot, you know, crimson orbs. Um, I don't know, the game may have potential. I I would need to play more, like know how the, the like since they introduced exploration and puzzle elements to like survival horror games like Silent Hill, that's all well and good. But then there's like a battle theme. But I don't know how it plays. Am I purely on the defensive and I'm just running and dodging things? Or is there a point where you're dodging and then you can attack at some point later on? Like like I was trying to say, like Parasite Eve 1, for those that played it. Parasite Eve 1's combat was also really cool. I still preferred playing Parasite Eve 2, though. And hopefully one day we'll get a Parasite Eve 3, because no, Parasite Eve birthday or whatever the fuck the game's called does, just does not exist. Just like Devil May Cry 2 doesn't exist. Parasite Eve Birthday, or whatever the fuck it's called that was on the PSP, it just doesn't exist. Either way, oh yeah, it was called Third Birthday. Doesn't exist. Um, I don't know, I, I'd have to see how the combat is to really have a full opinion. But since it cut short, I'm just left wondering, you know, like, like maybe I'll check the game store, you know what? The game store could hint at it. The store page also doesn't say anything about the combat. It just says you survive and you do puzzles. So I'm going to assume maybe it's purely dodging. Maybe. But anyways, I am dying for my coughing. I hope you enjoyed. It was an interesting game, but again, I'm curious on what would happen afterwards. It reminds me a little bit, almost thematically, with Dead End Road. Like the developers kind of, you know... Hmm. I'm not sure how to put it. Especially for those that maybe aren't familiar with Dead End Road. It's like, it's sort of a darkish, brownish... Hmm. Like a dark game. When the boss came, it made me think of something maybe that the Dead End Road developer would sort of create. Because after they made Dead End Road, all their other games have been sort of more miss than hit, in my opinion. And they haven't really made anything noteworthy ever since, to my knowledge. Because I swear I do follow them, but they only made the one game It was like this 2D weird game. I couldn't really get into it, and I don't think others did as well. Because Dead End Road was definitely popular. 
but then just everything else is just sort of this mismatch kind of eh but I don't know otherwise Risu wise interesting I'm curious but we'll have to see I guess when the full game comes out I don't know if I'll play the full game but I'm just saying I'm interested is it just dodging and that's it you dodge for a certain amount of time then you win don't know but if you enjoyed please leave a like comment hit that subscribe button big my fluff scarber hit the notification down below for updates on my videos thank you for watching until the next time Mmm. <sighs>